Hey, Shiva Rajaya here from VitalCoaching.com. One of the most powerful ways to stay cool uh, on this track is really to jump into these beautiful waters. I mean, jump, just go and refresh in them. I just went with my full body in it, and it really, bang, you know, gives you back lots of energy. It's now close to 10 o'clock in the morning, and uh, you know, it's not getting really hot. So when you are hiking, trekking through those mountains, uh, this is like the most welcome, uh, refreshing. It's like entering the fridge for like five minutes. <laughs> no, ser seriously, it's like it's clear. It clears your uh, your emotions, your thoughts. It's it resets your whole energetic system. Uh, remember that I'm on my way from. Uh, uh, all the way from Kiber village, I climbed to Paranglang, Parangla, and uh, now I'm on my way to Tsomoriri. I'm uh, still the first person to, to do this trek this year. No other traces on the snow, nobody. Uh, a few villagers in Kiber said that nobody had done yet. And uh, other shepherds that I met on the other side of the, the of uh, Kalalang, Kalala, Kala, man. Uh, they, uh, yeah, they told me nobody has come, and uh, no wonders. I mean, the, the the canyon, the first canyon that I went through, was really very tricky. But now it's good path, open, and most of the times I'm on the side of of the river. There, there is a track. But here and there, you have. Um, landslides that stop you from going so now it's a little bit of trek on on the riverbed and uh, hope i don't have a to cross one of these uh, big river branches because that would be tricky Just with uh, water up to my neck oh, but it should be all right i think that later in the year you know july uh yeah many hikers start coming this way so the path is open but yeah a refreshing bath beautiful